Hi friends, I'm Ellie and welcome back to the Tech Tricks channel. In today's video, I will show you how to generate a random ID in Google Sheets using AppScript. If you ever needed to create a random identifier for your data, this tutorial is for you. With few steps, you will be able to create randomized IDs that can be used for a variety of purposes. So grab your coffee and let's get started. I want to create this database sheet with details about each employee. In the last column, I need to create a random password for each employee. Okay, let's start with creating the headers. In the first row, I type ID, full name, hiring date, department, type of contract, email address, and employee ID slash password. Now I change the font style and size to make it more readable. Alright, for ID, I want to have three zeros and then one. But as you can see, when I enter a number in a cell in Google Sheets with leading zeros, it automatically removes those leading zeros. To solve this problem, I add an apostrophe before the numbers. Adding an apostrophe converts the number you enter into text, and the leading zeros don't disappear. Now I drag it down. The next column is the full name, so I type a name in it. For degrees, I like to have a drop down list. So on the insert tab, I select drop down. For the range, I choose the column. Now for criteria, as you can see, there are two types of drop downs. With drop down, I should type each text in these fields. But with drop down from a range, I can select a range instead of typing. In this case, I prefer to type. I want to drop down with three items, bachelor, master, and doctoral. Let's give each item a color to make it attractive. I go ahead and click on done. For the hiring date, I want all sums of this column to have a valid date with the same format. So I add a calendar to it. I go to the Data tab, Data Validation. Now for the range, I select the column. For criteria, is valid date. and reject input. Then I go ahead and click on done. As you can see, when I double click on the cell, the calendar will open and I can choose any date. Again, I like to have a drop down list for the department. So on the insert tab, drop down. I select the column. Then for criteria, drop down and I type each item and give them a specific color. I do the same for type of contract. I want a valid email in this cell for the email column. So again, I go to Data tab, Data Validation. For the range, I choose the email column. In criteria, I prefer text is valid email. 
then reject input and done. Now I add an image. Okay, everything seems okay up to here. Now let's go to the main part. Type in code for generating random ID automatically when these fields are filled. I go to the extension tab, App Scripts. Now I'll type the code. After that, I will explain it. All right, this is the code that we need. First, I define three variables. Sheet name, which the name of my sheet is database. Then ID column. Since the first column is 0, this column is 7. And at the end, ID length. I want to have 5 characters ID. You can change any of these variables based on your sheet. Now I have two functions, random ID and unedit. Random ID function generates a random ID consisting of alphanumeric characters. First, a string of characters was defined, called alphabet, which includes all digits and letters, uppercase and lowercase. Then we have an empty string called RTN to store the generated ID. Next, we have a for loop to perform through each character in the ID. The number of characters is determined by a constant variable called ID length up here. Inside the loop, the function randomly selects a character from the alphabet string using mathrandom and mathfloor functions. The selected character is then added to the origin string. Finally, once all characters have been generated and added to the RTN string, the function returns this string as the final random ID. Now the next function that is required is onEdit. This function in JavaScript is triggered when a user edits a cell in a Google Sheets document. The function gets the edited cell's row and column numbers using these methods. Then it gets the active sheet using this method. After that, it checks if the edited cell is in the column 7 and not in the first row. Using an if statement with logical operators. If the condition is true, it says a random ID value in column 8 of the same row using this method. Overall, this function generates a random ID for each new data entry made by a user in this Google Sheet document. Now I click on the Save icon. OK, let's check the code. I create a new row. As you can see, a 5 character random ID was created. Thanks for watching this tutorial on how to create a random ID in Google Sheets using AppScript. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative. For the next, check out this video that will help you to improve your skills in Google Sheets. If you find this tutorial helpful, please hit the thumbs up and do subscribe in case you're not subscribed yet. If you have any question or suggestion, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. And at the end, as always, thanks for watching. Have a good time.